directors of the Burke Museum of Natural History and Culture, and I've been invited by the Arts Council of Mongolia to go to Mongolia and teach museum professionals how to use archival materials. The materials have already arrived in Mongolia, and there are five different materials. This is Davy Bookbor. This is plank ethophone. This is silver cloth, twill tape, and acid-free tissue paper. And we're going to go through some sessions of showing the staff how to use these materials when they work with the relics and precious objects that they're um, taking care of in their museum collections. This is a prayer book or sutra, and it, it, it has a wooden top and a wooden bottom, and the string goes all the way through, and there are pages that are written on, and these are palm leaf, but they could also have been paper, um, very fragile, so I'm going to close that back up, and one of the challenges in Mongolia is to find a good way to store these very precious objects. Uh, one of the things that we can do is we can actually um, store them in the acid-free tissue paper. And I'm not going, don't ever cut with your object there. Always um, draw with a pencil where you want to make your cut marks. Take the object away and then cut. See, this one actually has a Chinese coin on it, and um, we want to leave the coin on, but, and we have an identifying tag with the catalog number on it, so we're going to take this tag off, and we're going to put it on the outside of our package when we're done storing this. So we're gently folding the tissue over, and we're just folding the tissue like that, and turn it over, and now we're going to do the same thing with a piece of ethophone. Now, I mentioned that this material is not in Mongolia. We're going to take some samples, and in the future we'll make sure that the staff get this kind of material to house objects. So again, going to measure one, two, three, four times, and approximately right here. So, so this is easy to cut with scissors. Sometimes this might be a two-person job, yeah, <laughs> to make the knot. <laughs> and I'm not making a really tight knot. It's a, it's a gentle knot just to hold the paper and the foam in place. <laughs> 